been getting in the habit of showing you guys the daily forecast. So it was kind of cloudy out earlier, but it did not rain. I don't think it's going to rain today. The sun's out currently, so I might go down for another sunset tonight. I don't know. We'll see. Time permitting. Yay! It's rendering! But then it still needs to be uploaded to YouTube. <laughs> so, um, today, hello! Today is um, Thursday, August 2nd, second day of beta. And um, today's theme or topic is um, talking about pets. So, um, I'm going to go look. Uh, Mischief's been out back all day. I've been working on this pretty steady all day today. Hopefully though, um, you know, it'll get up there soon. So here I am on Veda list number one. This is by We Blog, We Log. So on Schmidtastics, Amy Schmidtower. I'm also on her Veda list. So yeah, really excited. Today is day two. Things are going well. Hopefully things will go a lot quicker. Topic of pets. So before we get to mischief, I'm going to preface this by saying I am an animal lover, wildlife lover, nature lover. You know, I've had dogs, cats, fish, birds, mice, um, hamsters, um, pretty much the whole range. I would have a pet menagerie if I could, but we have a small area now, um, and I would love to get a dog sometime, so hopefully a puppy will be in the future. Um, but in the meantime, we have an only kitty. Her name is Mischief. We met her yesterday. She has her own website. Oh, I need to change her homepage still, but this is Mischief's site. And she has a nice little about page. You can read all about her. I'll give you the short story here in a second. Um, it's her, there's her blog. She has a YouTube. Kind of slow loading. I think it's because it's rendering. Well, she's got, oh, there, it popped up. She's got her own YouTube channel and she's got a Flickr. Um, a little bit about her, as I told you guys yesterday, she's going to be seven years old. Um, we named her Mischief because she was actually born around when actually we, when we got her, she was probably about, my guess is about five, six weeks old, something like that. Um, and I, my boss had found her apparently underneath his hood, like in the engine part, she was meowing. So mama, we don't know what happened to mama. So she was, um, I guess you could say a feral cat. Um, and he couldn't keep her because I think they already had a cat or something like that. Uh, so minute I found word, well, I didn't have any animals at the time. So of course we adopted her. And because we got her around Halloween, um, we named her mischief because of her color, because she's a black cat. She's, uh, that's a Bombay breed for those of you who are wondering. Mischief is named after Mischief Knight. Um, for those of you who don't know, it's I guess it's not necessarily a national or well-known holiday, but in many parts of the country, people celebrate what they call Mischief Night. Um, it's the night before Halloween when um, usually kids do little pranks like mischievous pranks like toilet papering trees and um, egging houses it's some of it which is not really very nice um, but uh, I'm not gonna divulge whether I ever partook but we named her mischief and um, she can get into a lot of mischief she's also a big scaredy cat um, I don't know if that's because she's not around a lot of kids in particular, but she is pretty much afraid of a lot of things. She's not well socialized. And I, I think that has a lot to do with the fact that she's an only kitty. Um, because when I've had other cats, they were kind of friendly. But, you know, every cat has their own personality. And she is a sweetheart. Once you get to know her, or once she knows you, then, of course, she's all lovey and cuddly, um, 
she actually, I think, enjoys going with us on our road trips now. She kind of settles down. We decided at one point in time, way back when, to just start taking her. I think it was really shortly after we moved out here to Washington. Um, she made two major road trips in her life so far. Moving from Florida to uh, Tulsa, Oklahoma. And that was a 21-hour trip. And she was in her little carrier and she did well the whole entire time I think because she was kind of scared um, and then the second one was when we moved from um, Tulsa to here and we had stops along the way and she definitely became used to she definitely got used to being a road kitty and when nightfall came and this still holds true now um, when nightfall came, she got really excited, and we think it's because she can see better at night. Um, but she actually, um, we had, we stayed in hotels along the way. Um, she got used to and looked forward to like where we were going to spend the night next. Um, it was kind of fun. Um, so yeah, um, and I vlog her adventures from time to time. Um, but when we take her out on the road trips, it's funny because she'll meow a little bit in the very beginning, but then she settles down and then she likes to look out the window much like a dog. So that's, yeah, she's, and we've, we've had a boat in the past and we've even taken her out on the boat. Uh, she wasn't too fond of that, but, <laughs> but as no cat would be, I would imagine. So, um, I think that's enough about her. Let me go see if I can round her up. And there she is. Just waiting for me. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. What's going on, huh? What's going on? Well, I have to go in and pick Mox up, so I'm going to bring her in. Mischief, where are you? Oh, there you are. Come here. She was just out front a second ago. So this is my backyard. Welcome to the jungle. Um, we have a nice little, we have for the most part lettuce over there and then some other assorted miscellaneous veggies over here. And there's the sun. I'm not going to go down and watch the sunset tonight because I did that yesterday and uh, so I think I'm going to wrap things up and start on dinner here in a second. So, beta day two and I think I'm going to, day one is up, I think I'm going to go ahead and upload this one tonight so I'm kind of ahead of the game. So, such a nice day. Friday is just around the corner and so is the weekend and see fair. I can't wait. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching.